Welcome, my name is Justin and I am a real estate agent and I have been for the last year. And I want to take a moment to explain to you some of the things that I have learned during this time. Today, we're gonna to be focusing on five misconceptions of being a real estate agent. So a little bit about myself is I've been in the nursing field for 13 years, 10 of those as a nurse, and a year ago, I made a transition into real estate and I've learned a lot along the way. So I just wanna share some of the things that I have learned with you. And like I said, today we're gonna to be focusing on five misconceptions about being a real estate agent. The first misconception is that real estate is easy. A lot of people, I think, believe that real estate is an easy job and it is an easy way to make money, but this is far from the truth. There is a lot that it takes to become successful as a real estate agent. Succeeding in real estate takes a lot of hard work, dedication, self-motivation, and education. And it takes a lot to make money in this field. I think that when people think about real estate agents or becoming a real estate agent, they think I'm just gonna start right in it and the money's just gonna flow in. And that's simply not true. There's a lot of things that you have to do. And I do wanna point out one thing that is very hard is that you might go for three or four months without making any money at all. So do realize that this field, it's not super easy like it might seem like it is. The second misconception is that being a real estate agent is just a part-time job. This isn't really true at all. In fact, it's something that takes a lot more time than what people might realize. And I can attest to this myself. For the first year of being a real estate agent, I was doing it all part-time. And while I was able to make some deals and get some leases executed, it wasn't a whole lot. In order to really be able to perform the best and be able to make bigger deals and be able to bring in more income, I have to be doing it full time. So it does take a lot of time. Being a real estate agent isn't just something that you can do part time or fit it in when you feel like it. Misconception number three is that all real estate agents are the same. This again is something that is not true. Every real estate agent has their own specialty and niche and has their own way of doing things. Real estate agents can focus on residential, commercial, industrial, agricultural, special purpose. There's a lot of different areas that they can go into. And so that is a big difference. Uh, finding the right real estate agent for the right fit is essential. The other thing is that each real estate agent does things differently and they work in their own way. So realizing that when you're working with a real estate agent or becoming a real estate agent, you don't have to do everything the way that people do. You can do things your own way. Misconception number four, all real estate agents are salespeople. That's something that while yes, we are in sales as a real estate agent, not everyone is in it just for doing sales. There's a lot of things that go into being a real estate agent. And one of those is people like to advise or help out others. I personally feel that real estate agents aren't always just as sales, but rather can be advisors as well. There's a lot of things that go into buying and selling or listing a property. And real estate agents are really good at advising and helping people understand that entire process. Real estate agents are really good at providing valuable services that people will need in such a big transaction like selling a property. They're good at advising on property improvements and staging. They're good at conducting market analysis and determining property value. And they are good at assisting in financing options or helping you find someone who is good with financing a property. Real estate agents truly have a wealth of knowledge that is super beneficial for not only the sellers, and, but the buyers in a real estate transaction as well. The fifth misconception is that agents are just there to show properties. I've heard it before, agents are glorified door openers. In reality, real estate agents do a lot of hard work that goes unnoticed and is often behind the scenes. Real estate agents are great at creating and executing effective marketing strategies for every listing. They're great at managing complex paperwork and legal documentation so that the clients don't have to do it. They are great at coordinating uh, property inspections and also they are fantastic resources for being able to provide guidance and support throughout the entire transaction. Real estate agents truly do a lot of work that goes behind the scenes. So there you have it. Those are five misconceptions that I feel like people believe of real estate agents. There's a lot more that goes on behind the scenes and there's so much that real estate agents do. Hopefully 
This kind of helps better paint a picture of what your real estate agents are doing. So when you're looking at possibly becoming a real estate agent, or if you're looking for a real estate agent to help you list your property, just know that they are doing a lot for you and that really helps you along the whole process. So there you have it. Those are the five misconceptions that I wanted to cover in this video. Real estate agents are truly doing a lot behind the scenes. A lot of stuff goes unnoticed. And hopefully this video helps kind of bring to light the things that real estate agents are doing. Real estate agents truly work hard and they do a lot for their clients. They spend a lot of hours, they put a lot of effort into it and a lot of time into it. And they genuinely want their clients to be happy. We've covered a lot in this whole video series. We've covered everything from how to become a real estate agent to the struggles and benefits of being a real estate agent and even kind of painting a picture of what real estate agents do and covering the misconceptions that go along with real estate agents. I hope that you have learned a lot from this whole video series and if you like these videos, please hit the like and the subscribe button. Follow along with what we're doing. We're gonna keep creating education content. We would love for you to follow along with us.